Getting salty with Silsic. Hey everyone and welcome to another episode. Always remember to smash that like button, hit that follow button, blow up the comment section, tap that bell notification. Alright, those are my special guests. I have with, with us today. We are coming to you from the Aquarium of the Pacific in LA and who you just met are the Brevard ICEF finalists competing in ICEF 2024. They are literally some of the brightest science students in Brevard County. This is amazing. So today what I want to talk to you about are cetaceans. So help me out group. What's another name for cetaceans? Whales. All right, excellent whales. We're talking about whales, and there's actually two types of whales. There's baleen whales, and there are two whales. Yes, uh, baleen whales. Great examples are like the blue whale right over my shoulder here, the largest of all marine mammals, and also the humpback whale falls in this category. Uh, the tooth whales uh, include the sperm whale, and what else? Dolphins and orcas. Excellent, excellent, great. But I want to talk about the baleen whales first. These whales have baleen, which they use to filter plankton. Ideally krill, they love to feed on. So they're actually eating low on the food chain. So there's less energy loss in that trophic pyramid. But we also have the tooth whales, and dolphins are a great example. Killer whales are a great example of this. Now, all the cetaceans together uh, share the same class. In, in taxonomic classification. And what class is that? Mammals. Yes, they are mammals. So now I'm gonna ask my group, what are some of the main characteristics that all mammals have in common? So I'm gonna start with Sarah. Uh, hair. <laughs> hair. Hair. Excellent, hair, great. What else? Live birth. Live birth, excellent. What else? Milk. 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 They produce milk. Excellent. <laughs> and, and one more main characteristic, our body temperature, humans have a body temperature of 98.6 degrees and it's pretty constant. What is that called when we have a constant body temperature? Warm-blooded. Warm Warm Excellent. All right. So that's just a few facts about uh, cetaceans. And like always, thanks. And thanks. Thanks for watching. Yay.